So basically, we're down here, downtown Austin. It's our last day. We're going to check out Turf and Surf, which we've heard phenomenal things about. We're here on, where is this, Congress? This is Congress and Second. Congress and Second here in downtown Austin. We're going to have some delicious seats. Waterhouse style. So what we do, guys, basically, is we have a big menu, and every item on our menu can come one of two ways. It's, it's one four boy sandwich or two tacos. So you get some options there on how you order, right? You know, uh, shrimp's definitely the most popular thing we do. Okay. I think Old Grim is going to, because I'm not a seafood guy, but I'm thinking that tango mango pulled pork. Oh, boy. Sounded a little delicious. What do you say about that? Yeah? It's very popular, yeah. So the tango mango pulled pork, I think I'm going to give that one a shot right there. I know what a taco is, but what's a pork? What we use is a, a whole wheat bread, all organic, made locally, independently. It's a multi-grain, whole wheat, nine-inch roll that kind of looks like that. It's oh, wow. toasted, you put the good stuff in it, cut it in half. I'm going to have to get that Aki tuna. Oh boy. You got it. All right. Uh, we'll go with the uh, South Side Philly. Southside Philly? Yeah. Okay, so with, with the Boston sandwich, it's, a, it's some cheese steak, right? So when we dress our poor boys, we add coleslaw, lettuce, tomato, pickle, and onion. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you. This sounds awesome, man. Southside Philly, ribeye with grilled onions, marinara sauce, mozzarella cheese, all dressed up. The turf and surf way. Check this out. Mint and honey sweet tea. Yo, we have this in New York, but this flavor I've never even heard of. Mint and honey. I never thought the two would come together and make perfect harmony. This is so cool. Watch this being made a little bit. You saw what it looks like, but let's get a little bit of a of a closer look. Check it out. I know you can't see it, but deep under all this stuff, there's still first look how, look how big this is. And veggies. Cheers, guys. Now, the last time that I had an IU tuna was over at a nice restaurant and the cake is ass. The flavors coming together, it's amazing. I would suggest getting this. Here we go, we got the South Side Philly that I ordered earlier. Take a look at that. That is insane. <laughs> oh my god. That is insane looking. He doesn't even have words. <laughs> it's that good. You know food what is delicious. Say? You're looking right at it, man. Yeah. I wanna, I'm going to eat both of these things if he doesn't eat that quick enough. That's, gonna... not, that's not going to happen. <laughs> All right. Old Rim got the mango pulled pork po' boy. I've had a lot of po' boys in my time. Hey, I was a po' boy at one point in my life, but we're going to check some loving out here. You want, you want, 
What? What? Oh, look at all this beauty. Now, there's one thing about Texas. That's awesome. That's awesome. What, man versus food? Yeah, man versus food? No, no, but it's similar. All right. Well, enjoy it, man. Thank you, brother. Texas hospitality. Loving it, baby. We need a little bit more of this. I think old Brim's going to have to put his hair back because it's going to get messy otherwise. Uh, we got some sweet potato fries in here. You, get, you do a good sweet potato fry, I'm yours forever. That's some damn good sweet potato fry. I don't know if I'm sharing with you guys. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> That's mine, baby. It's mine. Oh my god, that's delicious. That's oh, unbelievable. We'll take another one. Or three. That's not one. That's like fifty. They taste like these. Taste like Andy Cat hot fries, but sweet potato style. Popping up here in Austin, Texas, they become one of the biggest, biggest things here. Right on, right on the main roads, you just pop out. You see a bunch of these little trailers together, but Turf and Surf has been one of the ones that we've been hearing so much about. Absolutely fantastic, absolutely amazing. Oh my God, <laughs> go away! I'm eating. Got a gift. What's in there? Oh man. Oh. Oh my God. Look at that. Look at this. That's good. Oh. That's good. Oh. That's good. That's good. That's really, really, really good. good. Right in the middle of downtown Austin, sitting outdoors. It's a perfect day out here. It's probably low 70s, nice outside. You sit down in the open and have yourself a great meal, man. It's a good feeling. Good feeling. Brim, what really, what stands out the most about this place to you? Why, 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 why come here as opposed to checking out all the other places? Brim? Brim, there's, you're not. That's just sauce. <laughs> I'm not gonna miss a single bite. <laughs> no way, no how. This is good stuff. You don't understand. This is real deal, home style Texas cooking. We didn't get to have any any of this stuff since we've been here. Back in New York, you got like hot dog stands and stuff like that. But you have, you have to stand in line and wait for for your stuff to come to here. It's kind of like a little restaurant going on. There's a lot of seating. You know, the tables are all unique. We're actually sitting at a fire pit right now. And um, and there's tables hanging over there, as you see behind me. They're hanging off the top of the, of the roof. And and, uh, and they bring you the food. So you don't have to sit in line. You can sit back, relax, enjoy a conversation, enjoy the music. They have a very eclectic mix. It's not like it's not like blaring and too loud where you can't hear each other like you're in the club or something. It's a nice setting. Delicious food, awesome service. The owner here actually is the chef as well. He's extremely friendly, awesome time. I love this place. I'm definitely coming back here when I come to Austin next time. Yeah, I, I started Turf and Surf uh, a year and a half ago. I just My passion was always food, so I wanted to do food without the overhead. My other businesses, I designed and built high-end contemporary homes. I designed and built high-end choppers. And it was just a lot of overhead, a lot of fun, a lot of money, but I just wanted to chill out in my time of my life. 
So I came up with this little eatery called Turf and Surf Poor Boy. It's on Second and Congress. And we also do ta two tacos or one poor boy. I just think we need to eat healthier and uh, eat good in today's world. So I just wanted to do everything fresh and tasty. But I didn't want the overhead of a building, so I came up with a little eater, second of Congress. And, I, and also, I think we need to recycle what we got too much of, so I decided to keep Austin weird and use a ship container to build it out of. And to keep the sun off of us, I have a floating trap in my I just think we need to keep using stuff that we have too much of. All right, I'm going to take you on a quick walking tour of Turpin Surf Po' oh Boy. Let's see what makes this place look so awesome. Let's go check it out. Thanks, old Grim. And that is Turf and Surf Oh Boy. This place is off the hook. It's authentic. It's delicious. Ralph is the man. We thank you straight from the heart of the Hound Comics family. I can't wait to see you guys next year. Be sure you check it out. Thank you, Turf and Surf Oh Boy, for making our last day here in Austin memorable and absolutely delicious. Here, here.